Konnichiwa. Hello everyone. This is the duck in Japan. And today I thought I might like to talk about 3D printing. So one of you on YouTube suggested that as a topic and had said uh, two years ago you posted a lot of videos about assembling a 3D printer. What's going on with that? Post more. So I was gearing up to doing that, but another topic ensued that is related. Today what I'd like to talk about is my microcontroller platform, which you probably will have noticed is built using a lot of 3D printed parts that keep everything together. And I have a troubleshooting issue with this. The display is doing crazy things right now. It is cycling and scrolling in a weird way. But as far as I can tell from diagnosing it so far, it is still reading the temperature and pressure correctly. So it isn't entirely kaput. So when this first happened uh, several weeks ago, having left it on for a few hours, at that point in time, I had secured the screen up here with a piece of double stick tape and it was leaning over. And I thought maybe the connection was bad. So I designed a 3D printed part to hold the screen up and to secure it to the back of this popsicle stick that holds everything together. And so then I let it rip for a few days and of course it eventually did the same thing. So now in this troubleshooting journey, the next thing to try is, is this microcontroller board bad? Did I get a bad one? Uh, the ones that I have been using are generic boards that are based on a design from the microcontroller manufacturer but are made by random factories all over China. So perhaps this is a bad board. So now I'm going to have to load the same software onto a different MCU board and see if that eventually fails in the same way. And if it's not that, the next troubleshooting possibility is that there's a fault in the software that's corrupting the memory. So I will have to go down that rabbit hole if it isn't the MCU. So that's uh, taking you through the complexity of a journey here that involves 3D printing, software, hardware, and all kinds of fun things, but such is uh, the joy of uh, playing around with things like that. So I hope to return to the topic uh, more centrally of 3D printing. And it would be wonderful if you would provide some ideas for topics that you would like me to cover in the future. Thank you for watching my videos as always. Look forward to seeing you in the next one. Matane.